I'm Elizabeth Akin and this is my Rube Goldberg art machine for STEM. The most challenging part of the project was just figuring out a creative way to use the five different mechanisms for my project, for the machine. Um, and getting the Django blocks to stand up because it was a little bit of a windy day. Um, but when the machine was set off, the Django blocks would sometimes fall in the wrong direction which would not trigger the fall of the water cup to spill the paint. Another one of the challenges was using the dominoes. It was a very windy day and every time I would set them up, somehow they would just knock over. Some of the developments for my machine was using light. Um, I did not know how to use light at first for the project until I figured out that I was going to be using paint. So in one of the cups, I have used glow-in-the-dark paint. Another one of the developments were to put a golf ball to turn on the fan and the fan blows the cups until I figured out that the vacuum would be much easier to use because I would be throwing the ball that would be attached to the vacuum and the vacuum would just turn on without me using a lot of force to move the golf ball and it really didn't have a high enough power to really push the cups. Some of the materials used in this project was a shop vacuum, paint, cups, duct tape, wood, 2x4s, like mainly uh, a stick and a plank for the surface, um, a switch on light, string, a ball, and a lazy susan for the cups to spin on. So as shown, here's the piece of art that I've been sitting with this entire time. Right now, it's um, contracting the light from there to transfer onto the glow-in-the-dark paint, which should be across right here. So this was the beginning of the project when I was just coming up with some ideas, and I was setting up dominoes, and I was figuring out how to do and what to do for my project. Here's just a quick video of me setting up dominoes. This is just a quick video of how the demo would go or how the project would go. So the project is started by the vacuum being turned on, thrown by the tennis ball that is attached to the string, which is attached to the lever. Then air will push out of the vacuum and push the air into the cups and would spin the cups at the same time on a lazy susan and attached to the lazy susan is a stick once the stick hits the two by fours all along creating a track it will hit the cup that is filled up with water and once the cup is hit <laughs> Here's what the canvas looked like after the paint was dumped all over it. I take it into the dark to show the glow in the dark paint. And then here's the final product.